What is a golem, you may be asking? Well, today, you are about to find out. A golem is a creature with origins in Jewish mythology and folklore. They are creatures made of essentially non-living substances, usually dirt or clay. Usually, they are brought to life by magic to act as servants for those skilled in the arts of creation. Their appearance is basically straightforward. They would typically look like whatever substance was used to make them. However, they often resemble a human. When it comes to golems, behaviors, they are essentially a robot, just because they have a one-track mind, and that is to obey its creator. The qualities of golems often vary depending on what they are constructed of. Most golems are composed of earth materials in some form, such as clay or rock. Earth golems are often more strong and durable, though they may be slower than some. Now rare golems, they are created out of substances like air, water, or fire, in which case they are possible capable of utilizing that element in some shape or form. These types of golems are far more difficult to make and most are the servants of people who are very skilled with magic. Most golems have some things in common. that They do not eat, sleep, or even need to breathe. Now, you might be wondering, what can defeat a golem? Many golems can be destroyed by disrupting the mystic process by which they are created. For example, there are some golems created by a mystic, and as a finishing touch, they have an inscription of E-M-E-T across their forehead. Now, apparently, E-M-E-T in Hebrew means truth. And if you would ask me to read Hebrew, you know, good luck with that. Now, if the first letter is erased from the inscription on the golem's forehead, and all that is left is the word M-E-T, which in Hebrew means dead or death, the golem is out of commission until a mystic can go through the process used to animate it in the first place all over again. And that, my friends, is a quick rundown of what golems are. And apparently, when they are creating them, they have to be very careful not to somehow make the golem think that it has to attack them. Because you know where it has like a one-track mind. When they're making them, I think they have to be very, very cautious not to somehow you know, disrupt something and the golem will attack them thinking they're helping them somehow. Golems are pretty neat. I've encountered them in various video games. I know uh, one that stood out was from the first Dragon Age game. It's like a DLC or something like that. You can download one and have him as your buddy. But I think there are other, in, I think there are other games too. I can't remember really off the top of my head, but uh, this is Monsters of Folklore. If you enjoyed the video, let me know. Comment, subscribe, like, all that good stuff. Let me know your opinion, and I'll see you later.